Okay, this is Block D's Earthworm Dissection. They're all absolutely brilliant. Uh, big shout out to Joe, Harry and Maha who dissected this one. Hey, hey guys! Yay. Thank you! So, uh, the reason we dissected the earthworm is because they do their gas exchange over the skin and so we've opened it up to show just how big that surface area is particularly in relation to its volume, which of course is very small and mostly gut. So the kind of um, adaptations that earthworms have got is first of all they're covered in mucus so that the, they don't lose too much water and they live in a damp environment. They've got blood vessels running along the top and bottom and they may just be visible along here. And they're full of blood which is red like ours, it's got haemoglobin with a really high affinity to oxygen. And to pump it round they've got five very tiny little muscular hearts here. And they literally just squeeze on the blood to push it round the dorsal and ventral blood vessels. They have a capillary network very close to the skin for a nice short diffusion path. Um, and pretty much earthworms are gut gonads and blood vessels. These are the gonads up here. Interesting sex lives, earthworms. Ask your teacher. I'm done. That's what I know about an earthworm. <laughs>